What's your reaction to the John Terry situation today, please? Yes, I mean, uh, without prejudging it, um, what <laughs> should, he's it, been should, should, should he you still know, be England true. captain, or should he take the sort of dignified route of I'm going to uh, clear my name and maybe stand down? Well, I don't think he should be England captain while while this while he is charged with an offence of of racially abusing another footballer. I don't, you know, I mean, I think that is uh, well without. Uh, moving aside the presumption of innocence, yeah. I think in most walks of life he would have been asked to stand down now. And it's and it's such a totemic position, England captain. Yeah. I mean, are you guys, some of you probably know, I'm I'm a magistrate. I'm not in the no sense do I speak for the magistracy or, or in any sense or, or shape yeah. or form. But this the offence he's been charged with is is about the lowest that he could have been charged with so and that that needs saying you know mm. um, and interestingly if it was someone who came up in front of us me here in in Hertfordshire I, I had a look at the guidelines tonight you know because there are guidelines on sentencing so yeah. that people dealt with the same way as they appear at Yarmouth or in Truro and I had a look at the guidelines and it is an offence that really is can only be dealt with by a fine and normally these days, fines are based on people's income, mm. but there is a maximum of 2,500 for this offence. So mm. it's not, you know, whatever happens, John Terry is not he found guilty. You know, he's not going to pay. Yeah, but, but hang on, Mick, hang on. Pays, sure. But it will, but it should, I think, end his career as England captain. No, no, but surely the football it's, world will then have to react to anything that happens in the criminal courts, won't they? Yes, yeah. I mean, that's another very fraught point because there's always been this. This careful balance, you know, football has been at pains to try and deal with things itself. We, we're, you, your panelists can all remember incidents on the field which have led to court cases, Duncan yeah. Ferguson and, and and so on. Mm. But there is this sort of tacit, and because the law of the land isn't suspended when you cross the white line at all, the law of the land yeah. still applies on football pitches. Yeah. There's been this tacit understanding that that the police and the Crown Prosecution Service that they would let. They would let uh, yeah. football bodies regulate themselves. Yeah. Can, can I just interrupt there again, Mick? As a magistrate, I'm asking you this now. The Luis Suarez situation has so yes. far been uh, contained within football. But yeah. surely, from what the FA uh, panel have found of his behaviour, that is also a civil, if not criminal, offence no, outside of football. That's what we isn't said, it? Mick will agree with me. It can't be a criminal because nobody complained to the police. No, no, but, but surely somebody well, now can if they, they wish to. No, it's too late. Well, the, the, the difficulty is. How the, can you be offended I, I after you. I can't okay. complain to the police about something I've read about or. Exactly. Uh, you know, I can't yeah. say I read somebody did something. The difference with John Terry, and I think this is one for the future, is that it started with complaints yes. from people who had seen a video. Yes. And, and you know, we can all now. We can all now nick clips of videos. We can all take videos on our mobile phones. And so that's 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 the future, which is, yeah. I think, regardless of the issue of, of racism or John Terry or anything, I think, yeah. I think that is a difficult, yeah. thorny thing for football to come to terms with, that it might yeah. not be left to regulate itself going forward. Yeah. I can't, the other thing to remember, Mike, with, with Luis Suarez is that the yeah. standard of proof yeah. uh, at a, a football tribunal is very much lower than it is required in a court of law. Yeah. So... Sure. The fact that the FA have found him guilty doesn't necessarily mean he'd be found guilty by court sure. law. 